Hello, my name is Vasily Asmus, and in this video I'm going to show you how to create parent-child relations in COBOL 8. As an example, I will use a relation between student and student grade. Shall we begin? Let's open COBOL component. I have already created two sections, which I called grades and students. And I also created two types, which I called grade and student. And I created two menu elements, which are actually links to those sections. Let's start create our relation. First I want to make a notice that uh, relation between parent and child in COBOL is created in three steps. First, we are going to create a child field, then we will create a parent field, and as a third step, we will have to go to the child field again and complete its configuration. It may sound complicated now, but when we go through all the process, you will find out that it's uh, very simple. Let's start with the fields of type students. Because students are children of the grades type. In other words, grades is a parent and students are children. Let's open fields and add new field. It's going to be a child field. For easier understanding, I'll call this field child. In the group of parameters called relation, we have to configure two parameters. As a parent type, we will indicate the type grade. And as a section, we will also use the grades section. Because grades is the parent of the students. That's basically all. Now we just save this field. Let's go back to fields. Now let's open fields of the type grades. And now we are going to create parent field. And I name it the same. In the same parameters group relation, we indicate that the field is a child, which we have just created. And as a section, we indicate students section. And now let's save this. As I have already mentioned, uh, there have to be a third step. We have to complete the configuration of the child field. So let's go to the fields, the students, and let's edit the child field. Now, after we have created a parent field, we can indicate it in this special parameter. So now, the child field knows what is the parent field. So before we have created it, we couldn't uh, set this parameter. So that's why we have to create it in three steps. Let's save it. So actually, our connection is uh, already finished. Let's check it. Let's go to grades and let's create a new grade. Let's call it 5B grade. This is type of grades in Russia. So you have a number and a letter. So let's add few students to this class. So Ivanov, second name Petrov, and Sidor. You can also see that uh, while I'm doing it, the child is already set like a 5B grade. So after save, you can see that our 5B grade has three students, Ivanov, Petrov, and Sidorov. And if you go inside the student, we can see the link back that this student is uh, attending the 5B grade. Now let's polish it a little and let's rename the name of the field so it means something. So the parent field we will rename into students and the child field we will rename as attends to. Now let's see. So Ivanov attends to 5B grade. And when we go to grade 5b, so we can see that this is students. As you can see, it's uh, more simple than you could even think. I don't think you will have even more questions. But if you have, you are always welcome to ask them in the comments below. And I'll try to answer them if I can. Hope you like this video. Enjoy. See you the next time.